Hello, my name is Bill Lupton. Welcome to this watercolour demonstration. Um, today, what I'm painting is a view that um, we saw when we tried to climb haystacks uh, in the Lake District. But as you can see from the photograph, it was very stormy and as we got towards the top, we had to come down. So we didn't actually make it all the way to the top. You'll notice that the video is moving quite fast and that's because I've speeded it up so we can get through it quite quickly. Well, I've really wet the sky in this picture, um, but what I'm going to do now is add some uh, pale colour in there, almost grey-green colours, and it really does create a magical mist in the sky, as you can see. And this is just a screwed up piece of damp tissue, and I'm dabbing it into the sky to give the sky some cloudy, mild-looking texture. And now using quite a large brush, I'm painting in the distant mountains. I will start to try and add some mist in there by using a very wet brush and some tissue again. Now using a slightly stronger paint to add the middle distant mountain. And again with the damp tissue, just dabbing around to create cloud and mist. This is actually the slope of haystacks uh, about three quarters of the way up. Um, what I'm doing is using a richer, warmer colour. Uh, and nice and bright and I'll start to add some real darks in there to make sure this all comes very very much to the front of the painting. This was quite a dramatic part of the climb actually. Um, in this area there were some quite large rocks protruding from the grass. So that's what I'm painting at the moment. And I will use a credit card as you can see to scrape in the light side of the rocks and then add some more detail with the rigger brush later on. Uh, the large brush with a few browns in there helps to bring this forward even further. A very strong paint on the rigger and cutting in some cracks in those rocks, flicking up some grasses, again just adds a little bit of detail to this more important part of the painting. I wasn't totally happy with that distant mountain so I decided to add some more colour there, uh, give it a little bit more definition. Well we could say the painting's finished at that, I'm just adding a few darks in there but I'm not quite sure about the sky. A few minutes later um, we had to climb down very quickly because the heavens opened, it was really throwing it down with rain and that's the sky I want to create. So if I hold the painting at an angle and uh, really wet the sky with lots of water, I can then drop in some real dark paint and allow it to run down at that angle. And that'll create the more stormy wet sky that we had a few minutes after this. So here we go, let's see what we get. I really like the way the, the dark paint runs down the paper, it creates that gorgeous look of a stormy sky. 
Now here's the original photograph, quite a nice and dramatic scene, hardly any colour or depth, but the painting's quite different, with lots of rich colour, depth and a really rainy looking sky. Well I hope you enjoyed that demonstration, thank you for watching. Don't forget I'm on Facebook if you'd like to get in touch, that'd be great and um, we'll see you again soon. Bye for now.